Hi everybody, welcome to DC Disability with Karen Aura. and I am Karen Aura. and in this video today, I'm going to be talking about disability slang. So I hope you're nice and cozy, and let's start this year. What is disability slang? Disability slang or terms that some people with disabilities use to describe themselves or each other. However, these words are known to be derogatory because a lot of non-disabled people have used these terms in a derogatory way toward people with disabilities. So a lot of people with disabilities do not like these words. I found a whole list of derogatory words on Wikipedia, and I'll link it down below so you can check it out for yourself. I did type out several words from the list to talk about with all of you. Um, now, according to this list, um, the term able body is kind of derogatory because it's usually used with implied judgment. And the correct term nowadays for able bodied is non disabled. I admit that I do refer to non-disabled people as a beast or as able body. Um, I say a beast. And personally, I don't see anything wrong with calling a non-disabled person able body. Because if they are able body, then they are able body. I don't see a problem. Another word that I type is physically challenged. Now, personally, I did not like this word. I did not like this term at all. I am not physically challenged. Climbing a mountain is a physical challenge. Not having a disability, at least to me, in my opinion. Another one was, it's differently able. No, I don't like differently able either because it's condescending and as George Carlin talked about a lot people use soft language to describe things and differently able is very soft language and it's trying to cover up the disability in my opinion another word I type was Gimp and Gimpy. Now, I do identify myself as a Gimp, and I do say I'm Gimpy. I'm handicapped. Now, I don't call myself handicapped, but I will say, oh, there's a handicapped parking over there. And I think that's okay. Another one, inspirational. I have mixed feelings about this word. If, no, I am not trying to be inspirational. I'm just trying to live my life the best I can. However, if someone finds my story inspirational and it makes them be better in their lives, then okay, I'm okay with that. Oh yes, this is a big word nowadays. They call this the R word, which I think is going a little too far with it, but I'm talking about the word retarded. Retarded is a very derogatory word if used in that way. Another word that stood out to me is spaz. Oh, I'm such a spaz. No, I will say that 
about myself. If I have an involuntary movement and I jump and passing out. Personally, I don't think any of these words in themselves or derogatory. It is how they are used. And yes, they have been used in a bad way for a long, for a long time. But when you hear people with disabilities calling themselves or each other a gimp or a crip with a don't take offense. Because what people with disabilities are trying to do is take back the word and take away the derogatory feel to it. So what do you think about disability sign? Do you think it's okay? Do you not think it's okay? Let me know your opinions down below. Alright, um, thanks for watching and have a great day. Till next time, my friends. Keep rolling.